I'm Tara, I'm an Irish girl in the US. And one of my dreams is about to come true. I'm about to go shopping in Primark with the store all to myself. I'm down here before the opening of the new South Shore Plaza Primark store here in Boston. So the store is not even open yet. It's opening tomorrow. I'll leave all the details down below if you're interested in coming. But I am literally one of the first customers in here. Everything is ready and prepped and super tidy for the opening tomorrow. So I get first dibs and all the good stuff, which of course I'm going to show you. As usual, I will be doing kind of a bit of a vlog haul style video where I'll show you all the bits that I got at the end so you guys can kind of see the creme de la creme of what's in the store, what to expect and what to look out for if you guys are visiting Primark anytime soon. So hope you enjoy it. Let's get going. Alana, are you excited for Bostonians to see the new store? Oh yeah, girl. <laughs> We're excited. We're ready. Look at the yes. store. It's looking beautiful. <laughs> yes. This 40,000 square foot of store space is looking absolutely amazing for the opening. If you've never been to the US Primarks before, they're insane. Um, we've got the men's section over here. We've got accessories, women. Actually one of the first tops that really caught my eye. I think it's absolutely gorgeous. So I'm gonna find my size. I'm gonna go for a UK size eight. And these go all the way up to a UK size 20 or US size 16. So really good size range. Primark actually have some fab body seats in for summer so I don't actually have any in my current wardrobe so I'm gonna pick some out because they look really cute and I just feel like there's something really easy about throwing on a bodysuit with like a pair of jeans or shorts it's just I don't know does all the hard work for you so I really like this scoop neck t-shirt one I do like to cover up my arms just a little I think it's such a pretty color ring detail shorts I think these are quite unusual super fun piece for like a festival or something like that doing ruffles so well this season this is kind of a jumpsuit they also have a really really similar cute little play suit version it has a little cut out detail in the middle just follow this really interesting pinafore mini dress that has some really nice like military pockets cinched in waist and that sort of pinafore style strap for 18 dollars i've been loving the pinstripe from primark as you can see Yep, no surprise, added the pinafore dress to uh, my wardrobe, but I need a white t-shirt to go under. It should be pretty easy because Primark obviously have an amazing range of basics. So I think this one will do. I think it's the fit that's on the model there. So I think this will go really nice under the dress. Also, I had to show you these because I think they're pretty damn innovative, but Primark have come out with these beach towel bags. So you're thinking, it's just a beach bag, but no, it's a beach bag that turns into a towel and also has like a secret zip in there for your valuables. So really good. I think these are only $14. And of course the famous unicorn float that's been doing the rounds on Instagram. Just got rid of my basic pair of black denim shorts from last year. So I'm really happy that I'll be replacing them with these mom style jeans. I just saw them on the dummy and I thought they looked really good. So I think they're gonna go well with some of the things that I picked up today. I'm actually wearing my little Primark skirt that I got on my last trip, which does happen to still be in stock for anyone that's wondering. Oh, 14. Lots of nice stationery bits in. We were chatting about these notebooks being super cute. My favorite kind are the mini types. And I'm actually gonna pick some of these up because these are the ones that fit perfectly inside my handbag. This is a three pack and I just jot down my notes everywhere I go, blog posts and itineraries for travel and stuff. They're really, really thin and small. Um, like this is the size compared to a regular notebook and they're just so handy. Like I feel like sometimes these you don't necessarily take out with you, but these are the best. They fit into like any handbag. There's actually nothing like the joy of stocking up on fresh underwear in Primark. Super nice sort of faux leather cushions. They're only about $9 each, but I think if you had like a cool toned living room or bedroom, these would sort of add like a nice bit of warmth. Stopping off for some sandals because I really need some new ones and I'm not usually a bling kind of girl, but like kind of obsessed with these. Like how nice these look with a tan especially the rose gold ones. Oh my word, have you ever seen a more stacked carrot in your life? What a balancing act. Time to head to the cashier and try all this stuff on. Hello, back in the comfort of my own apartment. I'm gonna do a little bit of a try on haul for you guys, just to kind of give you a sense of how things fit. And I'm not gonna be repeating too much of the things that I repurchased from my last 
Primark visit here in the US that I did about three weeks ago in the Downtown Crossing Primark store. I leave it below if you want to check out what I got then. I got a lot of colorful pieces in that haul. This one is a lot more monochrome, but I think you guys will love the pieces either way. So let's get straight into it. I really enjoy the pieces that I picked up in here. They're very sort of mix and match type pieces. They all go together. So I'll go through, I guess, the shorts that I got first. I got two pairs of shorts throughout all my older ones because they were all just a bit nasty after last summer. This pair are nice and light. They have like a rigid, real denim feel look, but they're actually quite soft and I think they're gonna look cute. So they're just a little bit distressed uh, around the edges and I got them in a size 10. So I'm sure they'll fit kind of nice and snug and maybe like a little bit looser around the thigh. So I got those in white. And then for my black pair of jeans, you guys saw on the vlog, I saw these styled in the dummy and I thought they looked fabulous. And I just think the shape is great. Like there's nothing on these that's overdone or over fussy. Like if you know me, you know that sometimes I don't really like things that are like overly distressed. I just like things to be timeless and I don't know, like a little bit like streamlined, I suppose. And I think these are just a simple pair of mom jeans. So this is just one of the bodysuits of many that Primark had. They had a really good selection of bodysuits on this particular occasion. And this one just has like a little keyhole, not detail at the front. It's very simple. I think I got it in like a size eight or 10. And these were only like seven dollars, really affordable. And again, I thought they would look really cute with the white or black shorts. I actually threw away the tags of the shorts. So I don't know how much they're exactly. Hopefully they were in the vlog section. And if not, it's Primark, it's pennies it's going to be affordable so you don't need to worry about the price point too much and then to go with those two pieces i picked up two really nice tops the first being this which you saw me lost over in the vlog portion and it's this i think it's nine dollar top so it's just a nice white tee with the kind of faux bralette detail on the front and i just thought it would go really well with the shorts that i picked and i just think it was cute you know i am really fussy about details I just thought it was, this was a nice top. It's not too short, not too long. But just to add like a little bit of color to those outfits, I thought these might be nice, especially with like maybe a white on white outfit, maybe the bodysuit and the white shorts. I, I had to pick up these. These were the kind of, I don't know, nude pale pink blush trainers. These are just handy. They're super affordable, $15, and they look cute as hell cute AF my friends and I love them so I just got them in my regular size they're very lightweight I got a couple of beach essentials so first of all being like a good beach bag this is just a nice straw beach bag and it was nine dollars um, it just has like a little floral insert I probably would have preferred the print to be plain but I mean it's a beach bag it just needs to look cute and serve a purpose and I like this one because it actually has like a rigid bottom there's like a piece of something in there that keeps the bag quite structured. So that should fit quite a few things, including a new beach towel. I just like the fact this one wraps up. It's a cute stripey pattern and it was $14. I think it would go really nicely kind of poking out of my little beach bag here. So, so that's ready to go for whatever random Brooklyn beach I get dragged out to this summer. And then final touch, a good summer hat. I don't know, I'm not a very girly girl, but like when it comes to like a cute summer hat, my dreams will never die. So I think this is a cute one, but I just like the little braided sort of string detail on it. I thought it was just a little bit cuter than some of the ones that are out there at the moment. And then what's a summer without a few summer sandals? So you guys know I'm fussy. I think like the simpler, the better when it comes to some things. So when I saw these black, strappy sandals i thought i'd pick them up i thought you know they're nice thin straps they might look super nice these are actually um made for a wider fit foot i didn't notice that when i bought them but they kind of just look like regular they don't look crazy obnoxiously wide to me so the thin straps kind of just crisscross over your foot like that and they've got like a little ankle strap as well so i like things to be kind of secure on my foot so they hopefully don't rub as much. When I was in Boston, I actually forgot to bring my sunglasses, which was so stupid. So I thought it would just be nice to pick up a couple of affordable pairs, just to like ones that are not as precious as some of my more expensive ones. I can, again, throw in a beach bag and throw my backpack and not worry if they break too much because they're only $3.50. So these are actually super similar to my Ray-Bans. I thought they were cool. Oh my God, the circle, the ring lights, making them look like those Snapchat spectacles. Um, but yeah, super cute, really lightweight. And I got them in two colors. I got them in like a 
nudie pink and then the black as well so I think I'm fairly covered for you know on the go glasses with these two I think these will kind of go with everything oh how cute would the pink sunglasses and the trainers be with that all white outfit and then for a little bit of color because I couldn't resist in the summer it does get just super hot anytime I'm on holidays I just want to wear like the lightest thing possible over my bikinis and stuff like that and this is definitely something cute that you could wear from the beach to you know dinner or whatever it's this really easy kind of frilly detail red play suit yeah play suit yeah my mind kind of escaped me there for a second but again it has a tiny little keyhole detail in the front a little bow situation and then it also has some of the frills on the sides of the leg also down here so it's all elasticated it's elasticated at the back and it's also elasticated around the waist and this little fella was nine dollars so again super cute piece for the summertime i do love a good pinstripe and i saw this pin of four pinstripe kind of mini dress i guess it's not like crazy short but it's just like a nice summery length i liked the little d-ring details i figured this might look really nice layered with a t-shirt so i also picked up a basic plain fitted t-shirt from Primark which was four dollars so I'm just going to style this underneath really simple that is it for my Primark bits I love doing these hauls because I just feel like everything is affordable now like so many stores in Europe and the UK and Ireland and now over here in the US I'm just even more excited to kind of bring these types of hauls to you guys I've gotten such good feedback on them and I'll always do them when I can so don't forget to check out the new South Shore Plaza store in Boston, in Braintree. I hope you enjoy this one. As always, big thank you to Primark for bringing me over to Boston and hosting me there and letting me pick out some cool stuff. I will see you in the next one. Mwah.